Today's video isn't sponsored by, well, not sponsored by, but inspired by, um, Hassan Ahmed. Getting my review station set up. Another American review. Welcome to the review of the American version of DX Shri Kenjin. Here is the Shinobi Maru that was in there. Get him into his Dragon Bug formation. Or Shrieking Drago formation. Folding his legs. Raise his arms like that. And then. And rotate his head so that his face is completely not shown. And there he is in arm mode. Next up is, which this is also known as the Robo Red Zord, but we'll call them the Shriek Kinder. Shriek, the, uh, the, uh, not the Shriek Kinder, um, the Ninja names. So, next is the Ninja Steel equivalent to Dragon Maru, the Dragon Zord. And he looks pretty cool. Um, oh, I also forgot to mention his uh, details on Robo Red. Anyway, it's got some nice blue eyes. It looks kind of sky blue, but they're sky blue eyes. Some nice silver, some gold. Very nicely detailed. So that's Robo Red. Now the dragon has some silver. Some nice gold. Some black. Some blue. Some red eyes. Nitro has some nice silver. Some yellow. Some golden red. Now Kodiak's got some nice Blue eyes, some black, some gold. And then zoom. Oh, this one. This one was called Dumpa Maru. This one was called Wan Maru. And then here's Bune Maru. With some nice silver, some pink, some gold, and some red. Formation of Shurikenjin is simple. Oh, and also forgot. The Otomanin Shuriken, or the Power Star. And just for a size comparison, here it is with its Ranger State. I might as well show off all my uh, Ninja Power Stars I've collected over the years of Ninja Steel. So you have the Akaninja Shuriken, or the Red Power Star. And these um, blades are foam. So there you have that. Then the O-Red Shuriken, or the Zio Red Power Star. This is my first legendary red star. And then we got the Decca Ranger Shuriken or the SBD Team Star. Which this one is one of my personal favorites.
And I put this over here. And then my first one I got from Goodwill. And then my last one. The Keening Jersey Ken. Or the Yellow Ranger Power Star. Now, on to combination. The split they have of the Bumaru. Flip the feet. So you just raise the leg like that. Now we take one Maru, place it in this one, and you can do that. So take this, rip it off here, put it in the wheel, and there we have an arm. Now we will bring in this section. Bring it down. Now we'll do the drag information first, so. Or shuriken didn't drag out. Right there. There we go. Now, Drago Maru, you just remove his tail and wings, and then get him into a sitting position, like this. Now, what you can do here is attach the legs, like that. this off camera and then you can use the arm and I'll do the other one off camera now I just turn around plug this onto his yeah the wing. Oh no, do that off camera. Sorry for your blackness while I get in, in, in his dragon pose. In this pose, it looks like he's gonna take a shit or something. I apologize, but the, it really does. Anyway, and he fell. Oh, that fell off. Oh. Now 
Now you just attach him. I'll do the camera. And here's Dorago, or Shirk Engine Dorago. And now on to the regular formation. Alright, now that we're back, I got them they all into their regular mode. So now what you can do is, you can get this sword here. Don't fall on the camera. And then you just attach the shield on there. So you just attach the star on top, and then bring you back to him from the camera. And there you have Shuriken Jin. Mighty. Anyway, now on to our next review. Day. Bringing in uh, materials. And then we have 
Our American version of Bison King. And here's the Bison Buggy, and here's a little Rodeo Maru. So let's take a look at Rodeo Maru first. So as you can see, it's got mostly sky blue, some gold, some silver, some red. The Bison Buggy has got a lot of brown, some red, some gold-ish plastic. And there's a shuriken. So let's remove it. Let's take a look. It's got five star points, unlike the uh, shuriken, like most, which have four points. So transformation, you just. Pop up this gun, which has got some nice silver. Remove the shuriken. Oh, this is the Tomanin shuriken bison king version, by the way. In Japanese. Then you just flip out these feet. Straighten them out. Remove this section. Then we just bring in this section. And you have Rod Yamaru and that bring these up like this. And bring this down a little bit by one click. I'll do that off camera for now. And now that we have them, now let's bring in the star, or shuriken, and then attach the on here. And then attach the gun. And then here we have Bison King, also known as the Bull Rider Megazord in the English dub. Now we're going to combine Bison King with Shuriken Jin Great, the Ninja Fusion Zord, otherwise known as King Shuriken Jin. So, to get Shuriken Jin ready, you just remove his head and his arms. That's all you do for him. And then off timer, I'll, what you do to Bison King, you just Basically, rip him apart. Here we go. So real quick, we have this piece, which is basically a piece that will literally brace the hips, so that this the, the whole entire thing will never collapse. 
then you take the uh, Icing King legs and attach them underneath the Shurikenjing legs. Like this. Doing the next one off camera. Like that. And now he's getting pretty tall. Take the Bison King arm. Bring down his fists. And then attach the... On, and then... Plug this end of the hand of the red, original Street Engine. And bring the arm up. And there you have an arm. Doing the same thing off camera. On the other side. And then now I'll attach this on here. And then you just attach. Don't attach the arms here. Attach them above to this peg here. Like that. Now you got that going in there. Now the next step, you'll need these three pieces. So you just attach this bison head. Attach the uh, the shuriken on top. Attach the. Uh, Bison head on top of this, and then attach the Bison King Shuriken on top. Like that, and then. Attach the shuriken on top, like that, and then we raise the face up like this, like that, okay, something happened off camera. We will move on to this next part. So, take this here, take the shield, and then make sure to, to handle the gun of Bison King goes through that. And then, and then here. Stick it through a barrel to become a new sword. And then plug it into the hand. I bet. Let's do that off camera. And then here's King Shuri Kenjin. Zooming in. It's got some green eyes. It's got a light and nice detail. And he is just freaking tall. And now on to our third and final review for the day. And that being... And that is on. Wait, you know. All right, so you want to do this here or outside? 
Geki Atsu. And Geki Atsu. That's on Geki Atsu Dio. Otherwise known as the Blaze Megazord. First, we'll take a look at Ho Oh Maru. Or the Falcon Zord. It's got some translucent orange. It, this Megazord is, or Mecha, is um, fire themed. So it's called Blaze. And as you can see, it's got some nice. I don't know what kind of shade of red that is, but it might be metallic, some blue. And there we got that. And then we have Say to You, Maru. Or the Serpent Zorn. Mostly blue. Dresses in orange. And it got some nice metallic blue right there. And it rolls. As rolling things should do. And we have that. Then we have Genbu Maru. Or the Tortoise Zord. So got some green eyes. Some black. And then Visible Head Syndrome. It's got some yellow. Got six holes for the Megazord mode. And then there are sort of connectors. Anyway, next is Biako Maru, or the Tiger Zord. Some green eyes and some white. And then Panda Maru, or the Panda Zord. It's got some nice metallic pink. And you can... And the feature you can do is you can... Spin that like a helicopter. And then finally we have Magoyi Maru. Or the Piranha Zord. It's got some nice red eyes. It's got some nice metallic gold. It works very well on this. And now combination. You just attach the... Do the legs socket? I'll just do this off camera to both of them. And then you just the feet. And now just straighten the legs out. And there you have the legs all done. And now attach Siri Maru. Onto that socket there. And then attach Magoyi Maru on the other side. Like that. And it put that in. And now attach this on to here. And then take whole Maru. Put that in there. Like that. And then have his wings wrap around the shirt again. Oh, I'm about to show you again. Here it is. Forgot to show that off before we finish the combination. And as I was saying, get him to wrap around the shit again. And now to complete it, 
take these ranger darts. There's a red one. And then load them up. I'll do this off camera. Here you have get get style. 